Greetings, Padres. Welcome to this Thursday, February 7th edition of your Daily Bulletin. I'm your host, JT. And I'm your co-host, Sierra. Come to the game tonight. Boys basketball team will be facing Salinas. Admission is free with an ASB stamp. Frosh at 4, JV at 5.30, Varsity at 7. For all you lovers out there, ASB will be selling Valentine's Roses and Kindness Grams to be delivered on February 14th. Show some love. The first ever Carmel Amazing Race will take place next Wednesday. Race around the campus and be the first team to complete a series of challenges to win an amazing prize. Get a group of four and sign up in front of the cafeteria or email in the bulletin. Interested in running for a class or student council position for next school year? Come to a short information meeting on Friday at break in room 38. Applications and intent to apply forms will be on the My School homepage and due after the February break. Attention all bookworms. The library will be closed after school on Thursday for a staff meeting, so plan accordingly or bring your own books. Did you feel that? Holy moly, Padres. Be aware that today we'll conduct a school-wide comprehensive earthquake drill where school staff will activate their medical search and rescue teams with support from CAL FIRE. When the drill begins, please follow your teacher's directions regarding evacuation and procedures. You will also receive a text providing directions and updates on the drill. We all need to use this time to best prepare in case of an emergency. Please note, on the emergency drill, bring a warm jacket with you when the alarm sounds, since you may be outside for up to an hour. Attention seniors, the Church of the Wayfair and Richard LaSalle scholarship deadlines are quickly approaching. Be sure to check Navion's for the most up-to-date scholarship listings. Carmel High School scholarships are due the Tuesday after February break. Don't miss your chance for free money for college. And now for the club, club report. Math in room 45, athletes who care in room 33, Amnesty in room 19, D&D in room 17. And now for sports. Attention freshmen in spring sports. PE waiver forms will be available in the College and Career Center on Monday, February 9th through Tuesday, February 19th. You must turn them in on or before February 19th or you will not be moved out of PE. No exceptions. Now here's a look at sports today. Varsity girls soccer for specific collegiate at home. Game at 3.30. Girls basketball versus King City at King City, release at 1.30, depart at 2.15, JV at 5, varsity at 6.30. Boys basketball versus Salinas at home, Frosh at 4, JV at 5.30, varsity at 7. Community service opportunities. The extended learning program at Carmel Middle School is looking for student volunteers for their after school tutoring program. Contact Abby Hatton at a hat and at carmelunified.org for more information and to set up an introductory meeting. The AT&T Pebble Beach Pro-Am is this week and Carmel High School Athletic Boosters urgently needs volunteers to help with concessions. Shifts are available after school today, Friday, and on Saturday. You'll earn double community service hours if you step up and volunteer. Encourage your parents to sign up too. The, sh the social studies class with the most volunteers gets free pizza. Check the bulletin for more info. The Carmel Youth Center is also seeking volunteers to help at the AT&T Pebble Beach Pro-Am Golf Tournament, February 6th through the 10th. A meal shuttle service and free admission to the tournament for all volunteers. Register now at carmelyouth.com slash volunteer. The United Way is looking for volunteers to be greeters and screeners for the upcoming tax season. Contact Lin Lindsay Peelman or check the bulletin for details and information. The City of Monterey Department of Recreation is looking for enthusiastic, responsible students to, f to fill leadership positions in upcoming summer programs. Jobs include day camp counselor, playground leaders, resident camp counselors, resident camp cooks, field sports recreation leaders, and more. Must be 16 years or older, applications in college and career center. Juniors and seniors, Salinas Val Valley Memorial Healthcare has paid summer internships for students interested in health and medical careers. The commitment is five weeks. If you are interested, see Mr. Bork in the sports med room for an application. Birthdays today. There are actually no birthdays today, Padres, but have a great day. Stay safe out there. Thank you. Have a great day, Padres. Bam. Greetings, Padres. Welcome to this Thursday, February 7th edition of your Daily Bulletin. 
Okay. <laughs> Wait, what camera are we supposed Wait, to? Are we looking at? Hello, Pacific Grove. Hello, Carmel. We're your host. I'm Rachel. I'm Yvonne. And... I'm Rachel. And I'm Yvonne. And this is the 2019 Vapa Show. <laughs> the theme this year is water. H2O, yes. We're here to talk about good old fashioned water, not recreational beverages that form bad habits, but, but water. water. Tonight is about good, clean, pure, family friendly water with Brita filters and everything. We're not even going to talk about how water, water is, is not wet. wet. Rachel. Stop. 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 Now, something really amazing happened this year. Something sexist? Well, yes, but something else, too. What then, Yvonne? Well, for the first time ever, VAPA is being hosted by two strong, independent women. Feminism! Feminism! Woo! I'm reprising my role as the Lady of the Lake from Spamalot. And I'm Patsy. <laughs> I know, we love water so much that we drink eight gallons a day. Rachel, Rachel, but what about the woman who drank so much water that she died? Oh. She... Feminism! Feminism! <laughs> We've got a great show lined up for you today, and there will be four stand-up comics from the drama class sprinkled throughout the show. We'll begin this year's show with a collaboration between the concert band and photography. The band will be performing Waves by Brian Balmage. It's a piece that is intended to reflect the tranquility of the sea, as well as the grace and power of waves as they roll onto the shore. It will be accompanied by black and white images from the Photography One students, inspired by the long history of photography on the Central Coast. Here now to kick off the 2019 VAPA Showcase is the concert band with Waves.
find my father. <laughs> father, where art thou, Papa? Papa, can you hear me? <gasps> oh, you found me. I forgot. And, and see, thank you. That was a reenactment of Finding Nemo. I know, I know. We're a bunch of Fish out of water. <laughs> Speaking of fish out of water, next up, our first stand up comedian, Jacob Buzza, will be performing. Afterwards, graphic design is featured and will be accompanied by digital music composed by Zeke Spooner. Ooh, collaboration! <laughs> Poor fish. I've seen it firsthand. I would tell you my uncle's last words, but all I could do was gurgle. Yeah, it was like a Finding Nemo was a horror movie. And now a moment for our sponsors. Are you thirsty? Are you parched? Do you have a need for quenching? Call water, trademarked. Water, trademarked, provides all of your hydration needs. So why not give them a call? Call 1-800-WATER-TM. That's 1-800-W-A-T-E-R-T-M today. Give them a call and get quenched. Yeah. Now I know what you're all thinking. Oh, water, I could go for some of that. That's how I got started. Just one glass. Uh, another one would hurt. Next thing you know, start feeling all sloshy. GPA hits the ground. Skin starts glowing. You're out of a job. But uh, you didn't come here for a sob story, did you? You came here to laugh, so uh, let's have some water-related puns. You know, I, I had this one friend, right? He ran completely out of water and he didn't have any way to get any more. So I wrote him a card, you know, get well soon. <laughs> I, uh, I had a really good friend that was made out of water, but somebody boiled him to death. Chariot of water, yeah. The, the horses were really hard to rein in. <laughs> one time, this one guy came up to me and he asked me for a small donation to the local pool, so I gave him a glass of water. <laughs> hey, how do you make holy water? You boil the hat. I can't say that word actually. Well, uh, I know I flooded you with water puns, and I don't really want to dampen the mood, but it seems I'm moistly dried out, so I guess I'll have to wave goodbye and bid you au reservoir. See you all later, I guess.
travel costume. No, it's not. It's water theme. Ricky, we have no strength. Stop! 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 Daily show. <laughs> We're about to hear some real good tunes from the concert choir. Now the concert choir will be singing together in harmony. That is until everything changes when the Fire Nation attacks. Only the Avatar, master of all four elements. Water, steam, perspiration, and saliva could stop him. But when the world needed him most, he evaporated. One hundred years passed when my co-host and I discovered a new avatar, a music bender named Thomas Lemkule. And with the help of the dancers, we believe that if they can save the show. Oh, hold on, hold on. This is not about pop culture, Yvonne. This is about water. Sorry, I'm not very smart. Water. Oh. Next, the concert choir. <laughs> Next, the concert choir will be singing Wade in the Water. First published in 1901, the song is actually associated with the songs of the Underground Railroad. Joining the concert choir will be the dance floor class. The dance they are performing was choreographed by the Moon Water Dance Project from Chicago, Illinois. Mackenzie King, the artistic director of the company, attended Carmel High School. Mackenzie and her company spent a week at CHS choreographing pieces for the CHS Mappa Show. Please enjoy. Water sacred. 
Is water sacred? Find sacred. What does that mean? <laughs> Is water scared?
make you happy. Nothing else will bring you happy.